Travis Wayne Goodsell. All right, follow up. John DeLynn actually responded this time. Took him five hours. So an hour ago, uh, he replied. And uh, as I was uh, trying to get caught up on the past week's shows that I missed because of the impeachment hearings, uh, so much I missed out on because of this impeachment hearings. Anyway, yeah, so I have uh, Clarice muted, 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 muted. <clears throat> if you're unfamiliar with CBS All Access, they have a new show called Clarice. It's a TV series about uh, Jodie Foster in the from from the movie Silence of the Lambs. It's not Jodie Foster though; it's a different woman playing the part. So I'm kind of missing out on, on the show because uh, I didn't want to stop it and start all over again. But uh, I pretty much know the storyline, I guess. I hope I don't get lost by watching the end of it, depending on how long this video goes. Uh, so John DeLynn. I uh, replied with, it's nice to meet you. Thank you for telling me a bit about yourself. Do we happen to share any mutual friends? Are you wanting to come on the podcast? Question mark. And then he says, John. So, are you wanting to come on the podcast could be seen in two different ways. One could be that he's trying to find out if I'm desperate to come on a show <laughs> to get my 15 minutes of fame. Or the other one is that he uh, is offering an opportunity to be on his show. And so, not. Here's how I responded. As we both came out of Mormonism, we likely share many mutual friends and acquaintances who choose not to be our friends. I am willing to help you in any way you would like to help others. I'm not interested in fame. I don't do my videos for fame. People make fun of me for that, saying, oh, you only have 10 views. I do it for correcting the information that is incorrect by the church. Uh, I then add, I'm not technologically smart, but I have used once this Gmail video chat. <laughs> Was there a topic that interested you? So you see how I diverted away from the possible interpretation that he's wanting to find out if I want fame. So I let him know in a in a manner in which makes it clear what my intentions are. But still coded like a woman. Alrighty, uh, that's it. I'll again reply. I'll get into another video follow-up once he uh, does reply again. So we'll see. Uh, it looks like the Clarice show is just her assisting at FBI scenes. So. Maybe I'll keep you updated on that show. <laughs> She's not quite a little red-headed girl show, as uh, Nancy Drew and Zoe are. But, uh, yeah, I've been a big fan of the Hannibal Lecters. I have the TV series. I think I have all the movies. I have to check. But, uh, yeah. So, uh, that... Yeah, Anthony Anthony Hopkins, uh, brilliant in a disturbing way. But yeah, the one that really got me was I I think it's Hannibal Lecter, where or was it? No, it was the dragon one. It was the one where the blind girl uh, falls in love with the guy 
with the dragon tattoo on his back. And then uh, he, she finds out who he is, and he tries to kill her. And yeah, that that pulled my heartstrings on that one. So anyway, happy Valentine's Day. <laughs> <laughs>